the nine associated risks of AC. The temperature rise in most of the hot countries create an uncomfortable condition throughout the hot season, and ever since the invasion of the air conditioners, they serve as a lifeline for most of the household with children and provide ease for the elderly. But unfortunately, you have to keep an eye to the effects the air conditioners pose to your health, most especially if you lie on them for a long period of time. A poorly maintained air conditioning system, as a matter of fact, triggers an often an overlooked severe disabling headache usually affecting one side of the head due to dehydration. This condition is normally triggered and felt when you suddenly step in or out of a room after a long stay in an AC environment. This condition is often accompanied by nausea, vomiting and visual disturbances. The air conditioners cause the body inability to deal with heat. The stress on your body moving from a cooler environment to a smoldering outdoor air makes your body increasingly more intolerant to the hot environment. Spending a lot of time in an AC environment messes up with your natural body temperature and that's why there are a number of increasing heat-related death cases during heat waves. Think of a time when the air condition is set at a low temperature. We always tend to move less in the room and there is less demand for our bodies to drink water. Since we feel way too cold, this is exactly the time when the potential dehydration is higher in a room covered with AC without ventilation because the AC sucks too much humidity from the room. Excessive exposure to an AC environment causes a dry itchy skin and eyes. People affected with the dry eye syndrome should preferably not stay in an AC environment for too long because it worsens the symptoms and as I cautioned before, Sitting in an AC room for too long causes the skin to dry, though your skin might return to normal after a few hours of being outdoors. Air conditioners cause lethargy. Is your space over air conditioned up to a point that you're shivering? Just know you're three times exposed to lethargy, a condition characterized by extreme fatigue, laziness, lack of interest, and prolonged sleeping patterns. The device which cools you down even when it's burning outside is doing more harm than good to your body. And according to research, people who have air conditioners in their offices or houses were found to be associated with lethargy. Amongst people who are allergic to pollen and other air pollutants, staying indoors can help as it keeps them away from the risk of these pollutants, but not those with asthma and allergic bodies. One may think that the cold temperature would be better for your skin hot condition, Yet, long exposure to a poorly maintained air condition worsens asthma and allergies. Air conditioning units and systems cause the drying out of the nozzle passage, and due to the irritation in the mucus caused by the AC, the nozzle passage lacks adequate protective mucus, hence leading to the vulnerability of various attacks and infections due to the nozzle blockage and dry throats. We may not be able to live without the air conditioning systems, but remember to use it properly. There should be constant maintenance and sanitary procedure services because your body needs fresh air that only the good ventilation can provide. So it's always advisable to ventilate your room 3 to 4 hours to avoid headache, dry nose, and always be mindful to watch your healthy life living.